Yo, everybody, this is Game Master 127, and welcome to another Yu-Gi-Oh! deck profile. Today, uh, I've had this deck profile sitting on me for a while. Uh, I wasn't really planning on going to do these because Elemental Hero, Vision, Mast, E, M, V, whatever. Um, it's kind of like normalized. I wasn't really too comfortable with showing them off because I know, first off, this is an absolute terrible profile, but you guys like seeing these. So, here it is with the uh, Elemental Hero slash... Uh, Mass Hero slash Vision Hero deck profile. Um, keep in mind is this is definitely and by no means a competitive thing. I don't even think I have anything that's back row removal in this. Hello. So, uh, just getting uh, right into it. Uh, real quick, we're going to go into the five main vanillas here real quick, and that's Avion for Wind, Burst and Tricks for Fire, Spark Man for Light, Clay Man for Earth, and Neos because he's Neos. Uh, the next going up are just some of the other uh, Elemental Hero wrap-ups, and that is, of course, Bubble Man for uh, for Ocean, and I think it's Acid, Wild Heart, Ocean, uh, of course, his counterpart, uh, Woodsman. Yeah, th these, uh, in uh, Decades Dual Plus, the one for the Xbox, Having Ocean, Woodsman, and Stratos was just like the best thing all because you could just keep fusing and fusing and fusing and fusing. You could literally just burn through your extra deck with just those three cards. Stratos, I miss you, pal. This is this is for you, Stratos. Uh, Voltic to get my banished out. Uh, Neos Alias because it's a 19. Prisma to put uh, Necroshade in there. Uh, and if I don't have him, I do have Blazeman. Blazeman, um, it's actually a pretty useful card. And then speaking of uh, Necroshade, of course, is Necroshade. I do have uh, Blade Edge, because if Necroshade's in the grave, then I can get Blade Edge or Neos. So that's why he's in here. Captain Gold for uh, Skyscraper. Uh, and I believe my last element of hero is, of course, Shadow Mist, because I do have the Mast Heroes. So that is why. And it's only one because, again, it's I only bought one of the, the starter packs or whatever it was, Structure Decks, that had them. Uh, so, her, sorry, that had just these monsters, and that's basically what I just built it out of, was just that one deck. Um, next is then, I believe, my only Vision Hero. Yes, it is. And that's Vision Hero uh, Vion. Vion? Uh, it's a thousand two, it's... And it says, you know, that uh, once per turn, you can uh, banish one hero monster to get polymerization from the deck to the hand. So, and since he's a dark, you can believe going to Escardio. I don't have Escardio, but I'm saying you could. Uh, I kind of ran just all the Elemental Heroes I could, basically. You know, do I really think that people would run Captain Gold? No. But, like I said, it's just kind of like it's just fun profile, so that's kind of the reason why they're on here. Uh, so then, of course, I have Rottweiler, because it's Rottweiler. Uh, Phantom Magician, because you need the Spellcaster to help get the heroes out. And of course, you know, if you're going to run this, you're going to have to run it in GX era, so Wing Karibo, my man. Uh, King of the Swamp for uh, Fusion. Card Trooper to kind of pitch the deck a little bit more. Uh, Magician of Faith to help get some of the Polymerization or other, other cards back. Uh, and then Aroma Jar. And that wraps up all the monsters, because an Aroma Jar is just, by the way, to make the wall, because Aroma Jar is just an awesome wall. So, there we go, that's all the monsters. Going on to spells is two Polymerizations, one... Uh, of the new ones and one of the originals. I can't, th those are just really great. I'm so glad I have both of them. Um, Fusion Substitute is, in case I don't have those, and again, to bring them back for draw power, I have two mass changes to go into them. One Hero Lives, to mainly just go into Shadow Nest, really. Uh, two E Emergency Calls, one Righteous Justice, and then I believe that is my only back row removal card. Uh, one O Oversoul, one Reinforcement of the Army. To get them out. And then, of course, Miracle Fusion and Parallel World Fusion to banish and then unbanish. Hello, they all just fell. Okay. I do have a Mash Charge to target the Elemento and the Quick Place. Of course, Form Change to revert them back. I do have a Hero Mass to kind of act as like my uh, Prisma and Blazeman backup. I do have a Battle Fusion. Uh, because since all the monsters basically in here are fusions, a refusion, of course, to bring them back. Warrior Returning Life to get the monsters I have back. I do run Mystical Space Typhoon, I lied. <laughs> uh, 
a book of moon to help set up for uh, for them for my uh, monsters to mostly all have really high and then of course the two field spells are fusion gate and skyscraper which is why I run the back row or I'm sorry that's why I um, have it for captain gold and the banish so I can bring them back going on to traps are scrap iron scarecrow hero merges hero signal elemental recharge for life points paradox fusion um, it's kind of like the um, solemn warning, I think. Solemn warning for uh, for fusions, compulsion or evacuation gate, the gate attack, and call of the haunted. And there we are. That wraps up all the main deck. And really quick, going on to the extra deck before my battery dies on me is Contrastio Chaos. Again, two mass heroes. If it was link format, as you could not do it, I could bring out a mental hero core. Do like core. Vision Hero Adoration, probably the easiest one to get out of this whole deck. And then the Mast Heroes, I do have it for Wind, that's why I have Avion for Divine Wind. Mast Hero Anki for Dark, Goka for Fire. And then the Elemental uh, Heroes for the Elements is Absolute Zero for Water. Uh, Great Tornado for Wind. Fire is Nova Master. And I do, these are just the other ones that I need for, kind of just targets for, uh, for Prisma. And that's a Dark Bright, so I have it set up for Necroshade. I also run uh, Elemental Hero uh, Flame Wingman, um, in because it's just targets for uh, Bersantrix Avion. I also have Elemental Hero Thunder Giant, that's for Clayman and Sparkman, in case that I needed it for uh, Light. And I only do run three XZs, just mainly because uh, it's just the generic ones. And just in case I ever needed it, and that is uh, 39 Utopia and Utopia Ray, because once Utopia runs out of materials, it's basically a dead card in the water. And then Zubaba General, because it's Warriors, you have to, uh, you can equip it with Warriors, you know, uh, from my hand. I could give it, like, uh, Neos, I can give it Blade Edge, and then it immediately becomes, like, a 46 wall. So, that's why Zubaba General is here. That, ladies and gentlemen, is the deck pro. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I do appreciate you taking your time to come in and look at this deck profile of my elemental heroes. Mass heroes and vision heroes, I guess to an extent. And that is going to be it for me. If you guys want to see more of these deck profiles, make sure you let me know down in the comments section below. And I can do more. You just be like, yo, Game Master, please do more deck profiles. That's literally the only thing I watch your channel for. And so that is going to be it as soon as I put everybody back together. And that is it. Thank you so much, and I'll see you guys there. Goodbye.